You've seen QR codes just about everywhere, but if you have no idea what they are or how to scan them, watch this quick video. QR codes were made so that you can easily be linked to online information or downloads without having to input long URL addresses in your web browser. Now you can use Google Goggles or download a QR scanner from the Google Play Store, like this one, the popular QR code reader Android app. I have it right on the home screen. Now to scan a QR code, just hover the camera above it and it should automatically scan it. And this QR code links to the Android Noobs website. So it should take you straight there. And this is the Android Noobs blog roll on the Android phone. Now for a few more examples, if you have the QR code scanner on your phone right now, you can try this. This QR code will take you to one of our YouTube videos about the Utech Key charge pad for charging your phone wirelessly. This QR code will be a direct link to an Amazon product, which is the Anchor Astro mini portable charger for smartphones and other devices. This link will take you to the Google Play Store so you can directly download a game. You can test it out to see which game it directly links to if you want. This QR code links you directly to an image. You can try it out if you're interested. Now some other things you can do with QR codes, which is really cool, is make your own. Here at a website called qrstuff.com, you can make your own QR code. You can have it linked directly to a website by putting the URL right here, or a YouTube video that you like or may have made yourself. If you want to give a bunch of people directions really easily, find a place on Google Maps and save the location on here, and then they can scan the QR code and it'll automatically pop up on their Google Maps app. Some other things you could do, link directly to a Twitter account, Facebook, an App Store link, easily give your phone number to other people's phones. A really cool one is the Wi-Fi login, which is Android only, but here you could put in your Wi-Fi login information and print out the QR code and hang it up so when you have people come over you don't have to give them the password and manually type it in. They could just scan the QR code and link right to your Wi-Fi. Go ahead and give it a try. Alright, that's it for this video. You can check below for more details and links. And if you found the video helpful, you can rate it and nice comments are always welcome. And if you want to see more videos from Android Noobs, click the link down in the corner and be sure to subscribe for future Android Noob videos. Tell your friends!